Shout out, yes. Let's let's go down to Charlotte. Let's go down to Carolina and let's check in now. Wait a minute, we have a Justin Fields on the board here at eight. All right, the pick is in. JC Horn, South Carolina. So, Jonathan, tell me how you think the Carolina Panthers did uh, for draft. All right. Obviously, I wanted Justin Fields. Uh, I also knew the Panthers were going to let me down. I assumed we would be getting Panay Sewell at eight, though, which I wouldn't have minded. This close. We were this close. The Lions took him right ahead of us. Uh, the same thing happened last year with Justin Herbert, who the Panthers were going to draft at seven, but the Chargers took it six instead. Uh, we ended up taking Derek Brown last year, who was good for us. But, again, the value there of taking a defensive tackle in the top seven, uh, you need to be a stud pass rusher if you're going to do that. Derek Brown isn't. He's more of a run stopper. Uh, he can rush the passer a little bit, though. He's good. Um, but I wasn't a fan of that pick. J.C. Horn, he is my number one corner in this year's draft. So, And we definitely have a need at corner. So I get the pick. But at the same time, uh, it's Justin Fields, my guy. Come on. How are you going <laughs> to pass on him? Quick question. How, how stupid do you think that front office would feel if they take Justin Fields? Do you, th- I, do you think that had to do anything after trading away a, pretty much a second round? Well, he wouldn't be a second round, would he? Because he wouldn't play, so he probably wouldn't hit the the the, uh, if, the whatever. If you're not going to take him there at eight, mm-hmm. you trade back to somebody who will. But you think Chicago is willing to pay that much to jump – I mean, I feel I mean, like they were they desperate. They paid a future first. And no, I think the I... real question. The real question is, the real question is, does the Panthers want to go to what twenty? Twenty. No. It depends on what else they give yeah, that's, up. That's a huge no. drop. You. That's a no. huge drop of talent. No. I, yeah. I mean, they gave up a, a first round pick next year, and if you can get a second round this year, and a first round pick next year, ooh, sir. I mean, Sertan is good, but nah, Horn's better. He's got a higher ceiling. Uh, He's a South Carolina boy, so I mean, well, well I'm not a game Horn, fan at all. Horn, Horn wasn't I'm just saying from the, the South Carolina State. Not Horn this. wasn't the best corner on his team until last year. I know this RJ plays on that team. Definitely the best DB yeah. hands down. And- no RJ relation Roger? to him at all. I don't. I don't even know the RJ guy. I just Roger. saw him on the field, and he looks good on the field. I've never seen him in real life ever. He runs with DJ Swearinger. He will hit you. Um, he's a big hitter. If he's covering you, he definitely will. If he's covering he you. He's a big hitter. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Chris David. <laughs> Facts. That man. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so back to the <laughs> Panthers picks. Um, um, so, yeah, I wanted Justin Fields. I knew the Panthers were going to let me down because that's what they do. Uh, we took J.C. Horn. He J.C. Horn's good. But it's not what I would have done. I would have one taken Justin Fields, two traded back. Would you just took Darisaw that early? No. Nah. Ah, I don't know. Darisaw. You could have got well. You probably could have got Darisaw at twenty, right? Wait, what did you we could have got him at twelve? Yeah. If the but, Eagles so, were trying to trade up, we could have got up. the heads up. Um. Uh, Spielman came out and said that he got medicals on him. So Darius Hall fell a little bit. And because they said medicals. they got medicals that night. So Thursday night in the draft, they got there at 5 o'clock. They got medicals for him. And they're like, yeah, take him. Because he played all last year injured. So I see why he dropped. Like, that, like I see why he dropped. Correct. And he, like some teams, didn't even, he was off the draft board because yeah. of questions about his they, medicals. Yeah, 100%. But yeah, I would have liked to trade back and got Darisaw. Um, but you know, I like JC Horn. Uh, my least favorite pick actually is not JC Horn, it is the Chuba Hubbard pick. Chuba Hubbard. The running back? Yes. Yeah. From Oklahoma, that's Oklahoma State? Yes. 
So Chuba Hubbard is I mean he going into this year he was supposed to be like maybe the number one running back in college football. Uh, a lot of guys had him as a first rounder ahead of Travis Etienne, Najee Harris. Um, speed is his thing. He's uh, supposed to be a fast back. Now he's been hurt this season. So again, I don't have access to his medicals. But for a speed back to come out and run a four five, that's not fast. So why are you taking a slow speed back in the fourth round when there were players like Dan Moore, offensive tackle from Texas A&M, Tylen Wallace, wide receiver, Oklahoma State, Janarius Robinson, and Josh Kando, both freaks of defensive ends from Florida State. Uh, Tyree Gillespie, safety, Mizzou. Uh, there were five players right there I would have drafted ahead of him. Um, so hopefully the injury is what caused him to run slow and not just the wear and tear on his legs from being the guy at Oklahoma State for the last four years. Because obviously with running backs, we've seen they have a very short shelf life. Um, but... Yeah, I wasn't a fan of that pick. And so who's your favorite it came pick? out my favorite pick? Oh, you already know. Terrace Marshall Jr. Come on, son. <laughs> okay. That man is a stud. You got I, I am you got upset one. we missed out on Cosme though. You got one of my guys though. You got one of my guys. Who's your guy? The um, the um, uh Davion Nixon. I like Davion oh, Nixon, yeah, even I though like Davion he's Nixon, some would say he has a lot of quit in him, um, but he's he's built like an elite athlete. So like, it's up to your coaching staff to see if they can break it. But he when he's on, he's on. 